I'd managed to convince myself I was Jesus. Turns out I wasn't, but I'd started prancing around thinking I could hand out as much money as I wanted, which meant all our money was nearly gone. And Swanee wasn't helping, hanging out at Woolies all day with his tall friend. But forget Swanee, I had bigger fish to fry. A fat skeleton from the past had returned. Back in the day, the insane Papa Smirk had revealed his dastardly baby breeding plan. One for the husband, one for the wife, and uh, one for my giant baby army. Now he was back with his infant army, and I was shit scared. So I started marking all Papa Smirk's babies. Then I made them get money, money like them out. To fight Papa Smirk and his army, I'd need even more money. So I called the richest person in the world, Scrooge McDuck. For some reason, Scrooge wasn't answering. So I called the smartest man in the world, Stephen Hawking. Hello. Stephen, you don't sound very well. Who is this? Uh, it's K-Rod, little guy. Look, uh, I just need to know how to get all our money back. Make a money machine. Brilliant. Thanks, Poindexter. I got straight on plans for making a money machine. How much will this machine cost, Rick? About $56 billion. Holy crap. Can someone come and kill Rick? That was it. There was no money left. All we had left in the whole country was 50 cents. So I decided on a coin toss. Heads, I'd invest the money and get the country back on track. Tails, I'd buy myself a must stick. <laughs> come on, Tails. Daddy wants a must stick. Let's have a look. It's heads. Ah, shit. No must stick. <laughs> Kevin made this. 